the art of balloon twisting is just another way to express yourself through balloons. Now when people think of balloon animals or balloon twisting, they think of clowns or magicians, those that throw things in the air and juggle them. Oh no, this is me and you, you and me, those are the guys walking down the street with a pocket full of balloons, just trying to make a smile out of the passerby. -er. Now we're going to catch up with somebody here, his name is Perry Pattis. He's a local balloon artist down here in Fairfield, California, and he started out with balloons in a weird fashion. This I was working full time and going to night school, getting an MBA, and I went to a party and saw someone juggling. I asked them how they learned how to do that, and they said they were taking that at night school. And I thought that sounded like a whole lot more fun than the finance class I was taking. So a couple years later, when I got my MBA, I checked out and found out this guy was still teaching his juggling class at night school. So I talked a friend of mine into going with me and we learned how to juggle and I joined this juggling club and learned how to put pins back and forth with other people and juggle with other people. And so then I went to a company picnic and was juggling and there were some clowns there from this Clowns in America club. They asked me to come to the clown club meeting and teach them how to juggle. So I, I did that and I showed them how to juggle and then I saw somebody make some really neat balloons. Actually it was a big parrot in the ring. I thought that was so neat that uh, I joined the clown club and bought some balloons and started going around with everybody who belonged to that clown club to learn how to make balloons. Everyone has their story why they started doing balloon twisting. If it was something fun to do after class or you know, maybe they were interested in seeing a guy make a balloon animal across the way and decided, why don't I learn how to do that? Well, why do we do it today? Why do we get up in the morning carrying a pocket full of balloons and, and entertain people wherever we go? Is it the simple fact of entertaining? Or is it to get that smile on that Pastor Meyer's face? But, um, what I really like is it just catches people by surprise and it um, makes them really happy most of the time. What's interesting is the adults are the ones who really are interested in the kids just want something to play with. You're making a sword, you're making some kind of a little ring toss game or some clown or something, and they're off running around. The adults will sit and watch you for, sometimes for literally a couple of hours. Because I can go on probably for a couple hours without making the same thing twice. And they, every time, they always say the same thing. Kids must love this. After they've been watching me for two hours, they, they always say that. Um, Balloon twisters are everywhere. Hey, they might even be sitting right next to you. You want to learn how to do balloon twisting. It only takes three things. A little finesse, a little technique, and a whole lot of entertainment.